teacher. Teacher Dequa, hello. Llegué primero. <laughs> hello, how are you? Fine, ya llegué primero. At the first, the first. Yeah. Uh, before the teacher. How was your day today? Yes, I was working all day with my computer, sending videos, sending guys, uh, sending class by the classroom. I, I was all, all was good. Oh, well. good. Okay, okay, very good. So you had fun today. Uh, all the, all the class. All the my classes was very very good. All my classes were right. My class well. my class was because only one. Oh, I, only I, one. I, okay, my I class had a mistake uh, telling telling plural because it is one class today. Ah, oh, only one class today. Only one class is uh, sending video and sending guys. The other oh, no. the other week. Uh, I have a present uh, class. Present class. Uh, uh, those are. A... Uh, I, I don't know how the, the, the name is uh, presential. The, the, the students. I don't know if it is presential, okay? I think they are. Oh, how this class? How this class? Uh, you, you see me, you. You see me in class in front of you, and I, in my classes is is well is it the same? But yes, only I, I, um, that the I have of education had said that uh, we 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 weren't going to have uh, presential classes until next year. Presential classes, yes. Uh, I we have a week. With the presential classes in other week only guys and videos is a is there for a working uh, and the presential classes are in the classroom in the classroom yes and the we, children I, attend the classroom attend the class yes i i tell a present present teacher present teacher all the my students um uh, but I uh, we use Meet no no Zoom. Uh -huh. You use uh, Jitsi Meet. Yes, because Meet uh, has uh, in, how do you say enlace in English? Link, link, link. Ah, oh, the link. Oh yes, I know. Ah, uh, in Meet, in Meet is the 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 link, and I have the all my students in front to me. Uh, and I and I give the class. Yeah, I teach one class with Jitsi Meet. But uh, sa uh, Saturday and Sunday, I work all day. I I was a study. Uh, I was working at eleven p.m. the last last Sunday. Until eleven p.m. And no. Until, until eleven p.m. Uh -huh. and until, what? until 11 p.m. Until uh, sending so videos to the. Uh, what were you uh, doing sending, Saturday and Sunday? I uh, making making guys and sending the videos to the, uh -huh. the Tinder English, English for 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 kids. Ah, oh, okay, I see. English for kids. English for kids. Okay, very good. How are you, Ninive? Yes. I'm oh, sorry. How how are you today? Turn on your microphone. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> good, good. <laughs> good. Okay. And how was your day? Fine. Fine. Wait. With my kids, <laughs> I study okay. with, with them. <laughs> okay, very good, very good. And Bessie, how are you today, Bessie? Hello, good evening, everyone. Okay, so you had to work a lot last night. Oh, yeah, last night, 
today I have to continue too later than the class. I have a lot of work, thanks God, but it's not easy from now. Okay, I understand. Sometimes it's kind of a hard. Okay. Uh... Yeah. But this new normally. Yeah. Well, you know, sometimes you have to make sacrifices. In order to get... Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, in order to get what you need, right? Okay, let me see. What about my classmates? I don't know where your classmates are today. But for sure, in, today in you can you can see how many. Okay, so listen, Madeline. Tomorrow, eight. Tomorrow oh. is the personalized, the personalized classes. You remember from ten to eleven. Ah, uh, but, but uh -huh. so you are going to send attend. Send me the link because. It... So you are going to attend at. You are going to attend at a twenty, okay? Uh, at ten twenty. A twenty. A twenty. Ten twenty. A ten twenty. Okay. Okay. Ten twenty. But, it, but uh, I will link? send the link. I will send the link tomorrow to the, the to the group, okay? To the WhatsApp group. I'm looking. Okay, at the don't people. forget it. Don't, don't forget it. No, 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 I won't forget. Don't to... worry about it. I won't forget. Okay? Don't worry about that. Okay. Okay, let's see, Osman. How are you today, Osman? Yeah. Hey, how are you? Uh, I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. Okay. Hello, Osman. Hello. Yeah, okay. Hello. Very good, very good. Okay? So everybody is starting to show up. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Okay, so yes. how do you feel? What today? about you, teacher? I am fine. Thanks for asking. I am okay. fine. Ready, ready okay. to teach. Today is very interesting what we're going to see. Okay? Really? Yeah, okay. very interesting because uh, we're going to practice. We're going to practice today and tomorrow and the day after. Okay? Sounds good. Yeah, sounds good. Okay. Now let's let's uh, let's see. Uh, let's start. You know, and let me show you what we have for today. But first, let me share the. Okay, please. Let me share the the screen. Okay. Okay. okay as you know, we are working on the screen, unit three. The screen. Okay? And the name of unit the three book, is the book or the product line. Okay. The product, product line. line. I have. I have. Okay, and uh, as usual, we check attendance twice, uh, twice every session, and we are going to talk about uh, about that, you know, uh, later. Attendance will be taken twice on each session, and should have camera on when saying present. Students must say verbally present, right? Then platform completion. Tasks or homework should be done on the daily basis. Weekly task completion grade will be uploaded weekly. That is Saturday at 5 p.m. So the students should participate on the forum after every session that you have until the previous next session to participate. Okay, so that means okay that you can go to the forum like uh, at 11 o'clock the forum the forum is already open okay for you like today 
Today, I'm going to show you, I'm going to pose, okay? Now, we have a yesterday class, correct? And that was, okay, and we are going to share this, okay? So it's loading. I am in the platform right now, okay? Let me share. Oh, I'm in the platform. Okay, let me see. Okay, I'm going to share with you the platform, okay? Okay, so we have the beautiful picture of Vanessa, okay? So that is video conference number 16, okay? We, <laughs> okay. we, we don't know. And, we don't know uh, like Vanessa. For... We don't know Vanessa. No, she's Only very famous picture. now. So we're going to add a post. For example, is discussion, okay? The title, product lines. Okay, and what I want you is, I want you to share, share what you know. Say, share what you know about product lines. About product lines, whatever you know about product lines. Is that clear? Yes. So you can share. Yes. You can share whatever you want. Is that clear? So I'm going to submit okay. that. Okay. So you can okay. start sharing. Okay. 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 Very good. Now for today. For today, we have so for today, we have this. Uh, this is uh, the video conference number 17. And today we are going to make indirect questions. Yes and no questions, okay? So what we okay. call a closed questions, okay? So class objective, design mm. a basic plan for the manufacturing process of a new product and practice indirect yes and no questions. As a matter of fact, we are going to practice indirect yes and no and information questions too. And that is the objective. And the agenda, ask and answer the let's start questions, role play a conversation related to discussing the production of process of a new shampoo, practice asking and answering indirect yes and no questions, and discuss an article about how to design a process routing sheet, okay? So let's get started. But before, I want to see everybody. Okay, so how are you, Alicia? How are you today? Uh, good evening. I am great. Okay. Thanks how, for asking. How was your day today? Uh, today, my day it was uh, busy, really busy because I had a exam and I had to work many things for for my students and check the homeworks too. Ah, okay, very good, very good. Okay, and what about uh, Oscar? How was your day today, Oscar? Hi, teacher. Good night. And good evening. Think, Remember, good evening. Good evening. Sorry. Good evening. And I only work today. I stayed in my home, and I I I did home office, and only that. I only that. So it was easy day. day. Easy day yes. today. Okay. Yes. 
Beatrice, Vanessa, how are you today, Vanessa? Hi, teacher. I'm okay. I'm hungry right now. Hungry? Oh, don't talk yes. about that right now, please. Okay. Yes. Vanessa, <laughs> we want to know you. Okay. So how, how was? You? <laughs> how was? How was your day today? Kind of busy. Kind of busy. Yes. I didn't eat my lunch, so I'm so hungry. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, we are so sorry. We are so sorry. But at 10 o'clock, I let you that you eat anything that you want, okay? Okay. And the quantity that you want, okay? No problem. Okay. <laughs> okay, Raul, how are you today, Raul? Hi, good evening. How was your day today, Raul? Well, um, I only worked uh, at the at the at the house, and I only that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And Beatriz, how are you today, Beatriz? Good evening. Hi. Good evening. I'm fine. My day was fine. Okay, a lot of work today or a relaxing day today? No, today is my, today was my free day. Tomorrow I, I need to work. <laughs> I okay, to so work. my day off. Usually in English we say my day off. Okay, day off. Okay, my name. Okay, my day. very good, very good. Okay. So now let's get into business now. Let me see, I'm gonna get rid of this. I don't need it anymore. So I'm gonna go to, ah, before we continue, let's check some of the vocabulary that we still didn't do yesterday, okay? We talk about bulk production, okay? Let me share with you the screen. Okay, so sometimes we produce massively, massively. So that is called bulk production. Can you see a lot of products? Okay, so can you read, Alicia? Okay, bulk production is the production of the product in bulk. It is common in the manufacturing industries where the products are not customized and the consumption is ensured. And the consumption is ensured, okay? So questions about vocabulary. What is consumption? Consumption, consumption. is like, what is for example, what you consume. What you consume. And when it says right here, consumption uh, okay. is ensured. So that means that the man, that the man of the product is really a for sure so for example a, okay. everybody drinks orange juice so the consumption mm -hmm. is ensured because everybody soap everybody use soap so the consumption is okay. ensured, right okay now okay. customize you know the customize is not Good. personalized Customized. So you see, these products are a standard. They are okay. not personalized. For example, when you go, when you go, and uh, gentlemen, when they go to a tailor, you understand what is a tailor? Tailor, sastre. Yes. Yeah, the tailor. So that is personalized. That is customized. Okay. But if you buy a shirt, that is. Bold. That is not customized. It's a standard, right? Mm -hmm. Is that clear? So bold means like volume, volume. So mass production, mass production. Okay, very good. The next one is manual labor. Madeline, read manual labor, please. Manual labor uh, in in British English. Uh, manual labor or manual work is physical work done, done by humans. 
in contract to labor by machines and working animals. Okay, so this is activities done by people. Okay, so it's not done by machine, it's not done by animals. So it's done by people. Okay, next, what is machine hours, man? Make sure as one machine working for one hour, not a, lab, not, not a labor hour, you see in mesh, mechanized, meshes, mechanized, mechanized production, mechanized, mechanized production to apply overhead cost to working process inventory, necessary for, a, for cost according. Accounting. 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 Yeah. Accounting. Okay, so Accounting. Uh, in order to calculate, to calculate, okay, uh, the hours needed for a machine, so that is what we call a machine hour, okay? So is the production, the production that one machine can do in one hour. Mm -hmm. that clear? Working process. Clear. Okay, very good. Now, let's see, Ninive, weld. Well, to join two pieces. Uh -huh. So you can you see right there, to join two pieces of metal or plastic, okay? So we have different types of welding. So we have uh, electric welding, that is when, uh, for example, when they make uh, the garage corridor in your house, they do it with electrical welding. They also have gas welding. That is what they use for uh, heavy metals. And they use also what is called soft welding. What is used like, for example, with zinc, uh, with aluminum, Okay, and it is very uh, small. Like for example, when they put uh, uh, when they put pieces together in a computer, they use that. What we call it in Spanish, soldadura blanda. Okay, very good. So all that is welding, soldar. Okay, to screw, uh, Vanessa. Hello, Vanessa, are you there? Fasten one pin to another using screws. Sheet so. Hello, can you hear me? Yes, sheet someone. Okay. Uh, sheet someone or treat someone unfairly. Have sex with someone, make something. Okay, so a screw to screw has different meanings, okay? Now, for production is to fasten one thing to another, okay? Can you see that is to a screw? But uh, you probably hear that to a screw is like, for example, when you do something bad to another person, okay? That is to a screw a person, okay? And also have sex with someone is to a screw. Okay, is that clear? Screw. Okay, I, tighten. I need to know okay, tighten. Uh, Beatrice, read what is tighten. Tighten. Turn something until it fights. Tightly. 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 Pull of or be pulled until tight, become harder or narrow, narrower. Hold, narrower. Hold of the more. Okay, tight. so can you see this is to tighten? Okay, to tighten. Okay, to to loosen, to loosen. And I'm gonna write it right here to loosen. To loosen is the opposite. Okay. To loosen is the opposite of to tight. Is that clear? So look, to tight and to loose. For example, if you have a flat tire 
and then you have to loose, loosen up the, the bolts. And then when you put the tire, you have to tighten the bolts. Is that clear? That is a bolt right there, tuerca. Okay, very good. To adjust, Raul. Adjust. Raul, are you there to adjust? Adjust, change something to make it better, get used to new situation. Uh huh. So that means, hey, to adjust is like, for example, when you want to hear music and then you adjust, ah, okay, the volume, okay? Or when you are going to watch your clothes, depending on the clothes on your wash machine, you adjust the wash machine depending on the clothes. Is that clear? Adjust. Okay, what is a screw, Oscar? It's a base of metal. With a piece, a piece. It's a piece of metal with a thread. Threaded. Threaded surface and a point on one end <laughs> and a slot. A slot. A slotted head that is twisted to penetrate and fasten two things together. Okay, so threaded. This is threaded. This is threaded. Okay? Ah, okay. Threaded surface. Okay. Enroscado, coach. Eh, teacher, con rosca. Ajá, rosca, enroscado, okay? And okay. a point on one end. So that is the point on one end. And a slotted head. A slotted head, it could be like this one that is Phillips, or it could be a standard. Ah, okay. Right? Or even mm -hmm. it could be like with an alien uh, type. Okay? And Teacher. It to penetrate and fasten two things together. Okay? That uh, is teacher. exactly this, to penetrate. Teacher, Questions? I have a question. Yes. Uh, I don't understand uh, what is bulk. A bolt is twerk. Uh -huh. Bolt. Bolt. Or nuts. Bolt is perno, and nuts is tuerca. Ah, uh, but, but, but the, the first uh, that I read, um, when you when I mentioned, mentioned um, bulk production, what is bulk? Ah, uh, bulk is B massive, U -L massive. Okay. But uh, volume, mass, okay. volume. Okay, let me show you. Okay, no problem. Here, uh, Sorry. bulk. Okay, now look at the images. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, not that one. Bulk production. So we're talking about a lot of production, no one thing. Okay, massive, massive production. Mm -hmm. Pro massive. Producción en masa, o volumen okay. de producción, okay? Now, you say also okay. bolts, okay? So those are bolts, okay? Pernos, bolts. And then we have yeah. pernos, uh -huh. bolts. nuts. Nuts. Okay, wait, let me see. But I cannot see. Ah, okay. Please. Okay, uh, in a minute, in a minute. I'll show you in a minute, okay? Okay. Thank Let you. Let me get here.
Okay, I'm gonna show you in a minute. Mm -hmm. Okay. Hey, wow. Teacher, do you have electronic dictionary? Hey, I'm using the translator. Okay, pro vocabulary nutshell. Okay. Okay. Okay, so these are nuts, but these nuts also. Can you see? Those are nuts. Can you see them? Hello? Yes. 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 Those are yes. nuts. It's These a are nuts and bolts. Yeah, this is a bolt. This is a bolt and this is a nut. Okay. Okay. So we okay. use nuts to tighten, Thank you. to tighten something. Okay. Very good. So. Okay. Excellent. Now, are we clear now? Okay, now let's yes. go to the book. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Okay, let's go to the book, page what 27. Teacher, what we... Hello? Yes? Okay. Page 27. Do you have it? Page 27. Yes, I have it. Page 27. Hello. Page 27. Okay, so I will be able to design a basic plan for the manufacturing process of a new product. Okay, so today we're going to talk about process, manufacturing processes. So let's start. Don't with share, questions. teacher. Don't share, please. Ah, okay. Sorry. Don't share. I need to to look the look for the my, my book. Okay, so. There you go. So you will be able to design a basic plan oh, yes. for the manufacturing process of a new product. Okay. So let's go to these questions. Okay. Does your company manufacture products? Are production processes updated frequently? You understand what is the meaning of updated? Actualizar. So are production processes updated frequently? Is there a quality control department at your company? Okay, so I will give you five minutes. So you discuss those questions in pairs, okay? So I'm gonna break you into groups, okay? And discuss those questions. Okay, let's see how many we are. We are gonna make five groups. Okay. Teacher, excuse me, teacher. Update, actualizar. The page is actualizar, number update. Okay, so discuss those questions. Yes. Is it <laughs> okay, the, um, oh, uh, do you have the book? Yes, yeah. I have the book. Okay, yes, yes, uh, yes. 17 is the. Uh, no, okay, wait, wait, let me, let me create the groups again, okay? Okay, go ahead now. Get into your groups. Teacher, I don't understand. <coughs> what you don't understand? What do you have to do? You don't understand what you have to do? Yes. Okay, so you have to... Answer, Answer this question. Questions. Does your company manufacture products? So you are going to answer those questions. Ask and answer the question. Are production processes updated frequently where you work? Is there a quality control department at your company? Is that clear? So you're going to you are going to ask and answer those questions. Okay. Are you ready now? Yes. I don't know the bird update. Update, actualizar, actualizar. Oh, yes. Thank you. Actualizar, okay? Very good. So let's make the groups. 
Okay, here we go. Okay. Go ahead. Get into your With group, Alicia. please. Get into your groups. And ask and answer those questions, please. Ani Nunez, get in, please. Raul, get in. Ani, get into the group. Group number three, please. What's up, Osman? So, first question: Does your company manufacture products? I am alone. No, but... not anymore. I'm here. Ah, okay, teacher. Okay. And Annie uh, Nunez, repeat the question, with you. please. So, ask this ah, question okay, to yeah. Annie. Ask this question to Annie. And Annie, ask this question to Osman. Turn on your microphone. Okay. Okay, okay teacher. Okay, ask the questions to Osman. Question number one. Um, does your company manufacture products? Osman. Yes. Yes, it is that. Uh, in my company, uh, there, there are uh, Production process update. No, no, no. Uh, Number one, does your company in, manufacture products? I had to answer. Uh, yeah, the you have to answer that question. Does your company manufacture products? Uh, mm. For example, the company I work for doesn't manufacture products. We give services so does your company manufacture well products does your company produce yes, in, products? yes yes what yes, kind of in products my, in my company in my company produce a uh, manufactured produce uh, we we make clothes ah you For make example, clothes yes uh, in 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 our company it makes clothes uh, for example, uh, shirt, uh, pants, um, jacket. Um, for the moment, uh, we 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 are making a uniform. No, que yo for, a la hora de... for the moment, we are making. Uh, I don't know how to say uniforme. Uniforms, uniforms. Uh, uniforms for for um, food uh, for food football team. Ah, for soccer States. teams. Soccer teams or football. Soccer teams. team, yes. Soccer, okay. soccer team. Now, Osman, ask the question to Annie. Ask the question to Annie. Yeah, now, the I same have question. A question. Uh -huh. We talk about the the company that I'm working in this moment or is a example? No, it's the company that you are working. Oh. Okay, right now, the company that you work, do the, does the company manufacture products? Yes or no? No, because no. My, I'm working in college. Ah, in a, in a school or in a yeah, university. It's a, it's a service. In a school. Okay, so you don't it's manufacture service. products. Okay, very good. Now, question number two. I'm going to leave you, okay? Very good. Okay. Question number two. Osman. Okay. Uh, Osman. Our, uh, let me see. Teacher. 
Teacher, you are mute. You don't are mute. Yes, I was there in the group with Raul and Oscar, and I break out. You broke out. Yes. Okay. Let me bring everybody. Let Let me bring everybody. Okay, into the session again. Okay. I was I was with Raul and Oscar. Ah, okay. Please, thank you. No problem. No problem. They're gonna come back in one minute. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so how are you today, Rafael? I was I was talking with Raul and Oscar. Uh huh. But uh, because it's gonna take thirty seconds for them to come back. So what did you do today? How was your day today? Uh, good. I was at home and I had to work tomorrow. But and you didn't work today. That was. I was free today. Ah, I had a day off. I had a day off. A day off. A day off. I, I had, had a, day, a off. day off. I had a day off. Yes. Oh, Annie and, Annie and uh, Osman are, are talking a lot. They don't want to get out. Beatriz and, uh, and Madeline <laughs> are talking a lot. They don't want to get out. Very good. Excellent. O I like Osman talked too much. <laughs> Osman talked too much. <laughs> Okay, guys, Osman. very good, very good. Now, we are going to see this uh, Lucia, Marta, and Greg talking about, uh, they are talking about, they are having a meeting to discuss the production process of a new shampoo, okay? So listen carefully. <laughs> I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. So Marta says, I have, thank you. Greg says, I have, thank you, Lucia. So Lucia says, perfect. I like us to revise this step to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. So Greg says, Right, I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? <laughs> Martha answers, of course. Let me revise my files. So Lucia says, Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Questions about pronunciation or vocabulary. Teacher, I have a question. Yes. Repeat it, repeat it. I wonder. I wonder if... is like, me pregunto, I wonder. Oh, thank you. Okay, very good. Repeat More questions. It. Repeat it. What is the meaning? What? The meaning Repeat of what? It. Repeat it. Greg right. I like to know. Ah, repeated. Repeated. Repetido. Repeated. Yeah. Repeated. Yeah. Repetido. What else? Teacher, clarify is like dejar claro. Exactly. Clarificar. To oh. clear things up, to clarify. Very good. More questions. You understand what is the meaning of would you mind? In your mind, exactly. Would you mind? Exactly. Exactly. Te importaría. Uh -huh. Okay, very good. More questions? No more? Very easy. Okay, repeat after me. I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis production, production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you. I have, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> I have, thank you, Lucia. I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect. 
I like us to revise these steps to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. <laughs> Right, I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Right. right. I, I like to know the once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's, that's a good point, point Greg. Greg. Martha, Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost, the cost to run, run a second quality control, control will, go will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Of course. Let me revise my files. Greg, could Please. you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Greg, Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, again, I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. I wonder, I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you. I have, thank you. I have, thank you, Lucia. I have, I have thank, thank you, Lucia. Lucia. Yeah. Perfect. I like us to revise this step to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Right, right. I like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point. Greg, Marta, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Yeah, yeah that's yeah, good. That's good. Greg, 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 would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Yeah, that's good. Greg, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Yeah, that's good. Greg, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Of course, let me revise my files. What happened? Of course. of course. Let me revise my files. Let me revise my files. My files. Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Greg, Greg would, would you, you find out if the, the production manager is around? Is around? I need him, him to clarify what the revision, what the revision step is about. about. Okay, guys. Now, Did I'm going to place you. A, I have yeah. a question. I have a question. Ah, uh -huh. what is your uh, question? My question is, revise is the same review? No, revise is the same as check. Marta says, of course, let me re revise. Yeah, revise check is the review. same as it's check. No, it's no, it's not in the same. Revise is yeah. the same as check. And review? Check, check. Yes. Okay. Very good. Now, okay. we're going to go in trios, okay? Now, one of you is going to be Lucia, Marta, and Greg. When you finish, you switch, and you're going to make, you're going to repeat the conversation three times, okay? A role play in each role, Lucia, Marta, and Greg. Is that clear? Hello? Is that clear? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. 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 okay, very good. So let's make the groups then. Okay. So we are 15, three groups. Okay. Let me see. Uh, five. Okay, here we go. Uh oh. Wait, something went wrong. Sorry. Okay, let me see. Nope. Five, five groups. Yeah, five groups of three people, okay? 
Yes. So we're going to have to wait. So remember that each one of you is going to uh, role play each character. You're going to be once, you're going to be uh, Greg, you're going to be Marta, and you're going to be Lucia, OK? So wait that this is organizing, and we need 20 seconds, OK? So we'll be in 20 seconds, OK? Hold on. <laughs> 10 seconds, 10 seconds, relax. <laughs> relax. Three, two, one, zero, now. Okay, very good. Now, let me recreate hey. this, okay? Where is my classmate? Okay, so I'm going my to make classmate. four groups. There are... okay. I need two classmates in order to, oh, I, Annie, uh, Annie. Okay, there you go. Get into your groups, please. Get into okay, your sure. groups. Okay, I'm gonna go with uh, join, join, please, join your groups. Join your groups, please. Join your groups. Okay, Alicia, you're gonna be Lucia. And Raul, you're gonna be Greg, I'm gonna be Marta. Okay, go Alicia. Okay. Okay. Um, you are Lucia. You are Lucia. Go. Okay. I wonder if you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have. I have. Thank you. Raul, you are great. Yeah. Okay, go Lucia. Go Lucia. Perfect. Perfect. I'd like us to revise the steps to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. I'm Greg. Oh, Raul, you are Greg. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control steps should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run the second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the, revis the revision step is about. Okay, now you are Lucia, Raul. Uh, you're gonna be Marta, uh, Alicia, and I'm gonna be Craig. Go. Okay. I wonder if you received a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect, I'd like to, re to revise the step to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right, I'd like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Marta, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise my files. Okay, could you find out if the production man manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, I'm Lucia, you are Marta Raul, and you are Greg, uh, Alicia. Okay. I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. I have, thank you. I have, thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I'd like us to revise this step to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Marta, will you mind telling us if the cause to run a second quality control will go very high? Of course, let me revise the, my files. Greg, will you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, go ahead, practice it again. I'm gonna check the other groups, okay? Okay. Okay, Raul. 
What, what do you want to be? I start. I okay. wonder if you receive a... to revise the steps to verify that we are ready to start producing our new shampoo. Right. Mm -hmm. Right. I would like to know if the quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Finish. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cause to run? Basic oh. Windows not gain. <laughs> we are having problems with Bessie's audio. Bessie, okay, go, Vanessa, of course. Okay, of course, let me revise my files. Okay, so, ah, Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Now, did you role play the three? No, it's my turn to be Greg. Greg, and you, Alvaro? Um, I, uh, twice I have been Greg. <laughs> okay, so now you're gonna be Lucia, Greg. You're gonna be Lucia, Hello. Alvaro. Bessie, are you there? Yes, I don't know what happened. Okay, no problem. You are Marca. Okay, so go ahead. Um, yes. Can you share the, the conversation, please? I'm sorry, I will do it. Okay. Thank you. Let me check right over here. Uh, well, I'm sharing. You can see, no? No. I was alone. <laughs> okay. Okay. The, you can see now? Yes. Yes. Okay. okay. Who's going to be Lucia? Alvaro. Okay. I, Alvaro. Okay. There. I wonder if you receive a copy of the analysis for the production process. You are Marta, Bessie. I have. Thank you. I have. Thank you, Lucia. Perfect. I'd like us to receive the steps. Revise, to, revise. To revise the steps to verify that we are ready to start production. Producing, producing. Producing our new shampoo, sorry. It's okay. Right. I'd like to know if the quality control steps should be repeated. Once repeated, the repeated. Re repeated. Once the product is finished. Yeah, that's a good point, Greg. Martha, would you mind telling us if the cost to run a second quality control we go very high? Bessie. Of course, of course, of course, I am here. Let me <laughs> release my files. <laughs> okay. Greg, could you find out if the production manager is around? I need him to clarify what the revision step is about. Okay, very good. Now I'm gonna break you and I'm gonna bring you back, okay? Okay, very good, guys. Do you have to practice? Do you have the chance to practice a lot? Yes. Yes. Present teacher. Okay. Um, <laughs> attendance. It's time. Yeah, it's it time is, to attendance. Okay. Thank you for reminding me. That's my teacher. Yes. It's time to check the people. It's check time to check the list. That is correct. Okay, very good. Okay, so let's start. Jader, Edemer. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Eh, Blanca Hi, Vanessa, Stefan. I can see you. <laughs> Blanca yes. Stefan. There is Vanessa. <laughs> okay. Oh my God. Maria Eugenia Cruz. I'm here, present. Okay, Jada very is good, here very good. Teacher. Betsy Anayensi. Present. Thank you. Present. Oscar Eduardo Majano. Present. Thank you. Raul Mauricio Rivera. Yes, Very good. Uh, Ninive Sarai Hernandez. Present. Thank you. 
Marta Beatriz Alegría. Present. Thank you. Eh, Álvaro Enrique Rivas. Present. Thank you. Eh, Rafael René Molina. Present, sir. Ok. María Adelina Araya Menéndez. Present, teacher. Very good. Alicia Carolina López. Alicia Carolina López. Alicia. Alicia. Ajá. Muy. Ok. Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Always. Cecilia Fuentes. Daniel Osvaldo Pérez. <coughs> Daniel Osvaldo Pérez. Daniel is not present. Ok, uh, Verónica Beatriz Mendoza. Is not present. Ok, Ana del Carmen Cortés. Present teacher. Thank you. Andrea Alexandra. Kenia. Johanna. Vanessa Alexandra. Present. Ok, very good. And now, let's, let's see. Okay, uh, let's answer these questions quickly and then we're going to talk about some topics of your interest. Okay, now, uh, let's answer these questions based in the conversation. Okay, ask question number one, Ana Yancy. Okay, what is the new product, Lucia? Marta and Greg are discussing about. What is the new product? The shampoo. What is the new shampoo? Product? Shampoo. Please. Correct. Very good. Shampoo. Okay. So now the next question. Uh, Maria Eugenia. Okay. What what are two steps of the production process they mentioned? Main. Mentioned. Sorry? Mention it in the conversation. Uh -huh. What are the two steps of the production process they mentioned in the conversation? Do you remember what are the two steps? The quality control. What? The quality, quality control. control and? Should be repeated. Pro no, and producing. Then, and red. So one and is the quality control steps. And the other mm -hmm. one is the cost. The cost to run the a cost. second, cost to run a second quality, quality control. control. Mm -hmm. Okay, now, next, number three. Ask the question, uh, Jagger. Okay, what did Greg suggest about the production process? Okay, what did Greg suggest about the production process? Wrong second quality control. Hello, what the Greg uh, suggest? I don't remember. Sorry. What did Greg suggest about the production process? They should repeat no, the, the quality, quality control. control. Uh -huh. If the quality should be repeated, should be repeated. Should be repeated. The quality control step should be repeated once the product is finished. Okay, very good, very good. Teacher, control or control? Control. Control. Quality control. control. Okay, now, here we go. Control. Okay, now, how this uh, product is made, okay? Now, we are going to watch that, okay, tomorrow. Now, today, how to use indirect questions? Yes and no questions, okay? Direct. How to use indirect questions? Okay, so look at examples in the box. Okay, but before, I want you to look at this. Okay, remember that uh, on, the, on, the, on the file that I sent you, you have these links. Okay, let me show you. Let me share this.
Okay. Do you remember that file that I sent you? Okay, so I already uploaded the first link. Okay, and that link I have it ready right here. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have it ready right here. Which one? The first link that I sent. Remember that I sent you the first. a file. Okay, so it's the first link. If you can upload it, this link is only an explanation. Okay, now we have a direct question. For example, what's your name? Okay, that is a direct question. Okay, let's see here. What are indirect questions? So as I was explaining, as I was explaining, a direct question is, what's your name? So you answer me. Okay, my name is... Hi. Which, which is the fish? Okay, that is the first link. Universal. The first link. Wait. No. The first link. You share the first link, teacher, please. Yeah, it's in the page that I sent you. You remember? Okay. Please you remember that I sent you share. this? Let don't me share. show you. Don't, don't share. Don't share, please. I need to look for. Hold, hold on. Okay, so you remember this. Let me show you. You remember in the in the file that I sent you with the vocabulary. You remember this page? Yes. Okay. At the yes. end, at the yes. end, we have the indirect question. We have all these links. Okay. Yes. Now, the first one, the first link is the one that I uploaded. That first link is the explanation that we are looking at right now. This one right here. Direct mm -hmm. and indirect questions. Okay. So, as I was saying, direct question, what is your name? As you can see, the Teacher. direct question like has this. a structure, okay? Teacher, please don't share, don't share, please. I need to look for. Listen, listen right now. Direct questions, okay? Are you, are you hungry? So that is a direct question. Now, indirect question is, I want to know if you are hungry is that clear yes no okay so direct question are you hungry yes or no uh -huh. now indirect question i want to know or could you tell me please if you are hungry could you tell me is that clear so that is an like question. okay now but okay like what is the difference yes, what is the difference <laughs> The difference is For direct Martin. question. Now, when I when I introduce my question, the direct question, when I introduce my direct question with an expression, I make an indirect question. Okay? For example, when I say, I want to know if you are hungry. You see, I introduce the question with an expression. Or I can use another question. Could you tell me or can you tell me if you are hungry? Okay. Now, when do we use indirect questions? Okay. We use indirect questions when we don't know the people. Okay. So let's take a look. Now I'm going to share. I'm going to share. This is the link. What are indirect questions? Direct questions are the normal questions that we can ask friends, family, members, and people who we know well. You can form direct questions using the quas model that we learned last lesson. Example of a direct question. 
where is the bathroom? That is a direct question. Mm -hmm. Now, yes. indirect questions are a little more formal and polite. We use them when talking to a person we don't know very well or in professional situations. And their form is a little different, okay? Example of an indirect question. Could you tell me where the bathroom is? And can you see, we place the question as if it were an affirmative <clears throat> statement. Look at the position here in the direct question. And look at the position here in the indirect question. It's different. Mm -hmm. you yes, understand? I understand. Yes. Okay. The part to be is at the end. Uh, not exactly at the end. You, you use it as if it were an affirmative statement. Ok, I'm going to say this in Spanish. Va a poner la pregunta como que si fuera una oración. Ok? Mm -hmm. Ok, now, these are the expressions, the most common expressions to introduce, to introduce an indirect question. Ok? And the purpose to use indirect question is when we want to be polite. Okay, it's not the same, it's not the same if I ask your brother or if I ask my sister, hey, what day is today? Hey, can you pass me the salt? But when we want to be more polite or we don't know the people, we use indirect question. Hey, would you mind passing me the salt? Could you, uh, I was wondering, if this is the bus stop. Is that clear? Okay. Okay. So these are the expressions, the most common expressions to use to introduce a direct, indirect Teacher. question. Now, Teacher, direct question. question is... Teacher. Yes? I have a question. Um, I have a... In the phrases for indirect question, the third said, I was wondering after uh -huh. this. You remember you that I was said, yeah, comma. you remember no, that no. I said in the book, if I wonder if, right? You remember somebody asked me, I wonder if. So yeah. I told you that the meaning is, me pregunto si. No. So here, but, I was wondering means me estoy me estaba preguntando. But my question is, after this, you put comma. No. Or not is necessary. No. Yeah. No. Take a look. Can you see right here is the example? Yes. Could you tell me where the bathroom is? So you don't use a comma. Now you gotta be careful. That, but when it's you, like a question. And I'm sorry? I, I think in my mind is the, the example don't have a comma because it's like a question. And the, the I was wondering is like, I don't know, um, like answer. Yeah, uh, okay, now. What is the difference? Can you see here? Could you tell me? It's a question. Okay? And the okay. question is right here. But when I introduce a indirect question with a question, I have to write the question mark. Okay? But if I use this, that is not a question to introduce my indirect question, you don't use the question mark. You use a period. Vale, voy a decir esto en español para que quede claro. Si yo voy a introducir mi pregunta indirecta con una pregunta, como en este caso, uso el signo de interrogación. Pero si yo voy a introducir mi pregunta con una expresión que no es una pregunta, entonces voy a terminar la pregunta con un punto. Is that clear? Yes. Yes? Exactly. yes. Okay, very good. Now, like for example, I like to know. 
So in that case, I'm going to end the question with a period. Okay? Now, let's take a look. Can you see here? Could you tell me where the Market Street is? Now, the direct question uh -huh. is, where is where Market, Market Street? Street? Where is? So you place the auxiliary verb after the subject. Could you tell me where the Market Street is? Is that clear? Yes. Okay, very good. Now, in indirect question with is and are, the verb is comes after the subject. What time, okay, in this case. Now, look at here. What time does the bank open? Mm -hmm. So when I make the indirect question, do you know what time the bank mm -hmm. opens? Like if it were an affirmative statement. So I don't use does, and I write the third person singular because I refer to a singular subject. Is that clear? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Okay. Now, in indirect okay. question, we don't use the auxiliary verbs do, does, and did in the past. Also, you can see the verb is open in the third in the direct question and opens mm -hmm. in the indirect question because it's third person singular. Now, in the okay. in the case, if it were the past tense, why did you move to Europe? That is the direct question. Now, in direct question, I was wondering, can you see? I was wondering, it's not a question. Look, I end up with a period. Is that clear? Because it's not a question. Mm -hmm. This is a question, yes. you know what? And then I end up with a question mark. Mm -hmm. Okay? Now, okay. let's see. I was wondering why, why? Now, I, I eliminate it, but I need the past tense. Why uh -huh. you moved to Europe? Is that clear? Because yes. I use my in my direct question, I use it like an affirmative statement in the indirect question. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Again, there is no auxiliary verb did in the indirect question. In fact, this indirect question isn't even a question, it's more of a statement that invites the other person to give more information. And instead of did, okay. because it's in the past, I have to use the past tense of the verb, okay? okay? Now, this is in the present perfect. You remember present perfect? How has he managed to get in shape so quickly? So now, indirect, do you have any idea how he, and I invert this, how he has managed how he has managed to get in shape so quickly. Why? Because I transformed this question into an affirmative statement. And mm -hmm. to do that, I place has right here after he. And that is the contraction mm -hmm. right there. He has. Okay? He mm -hmm. has managed to get in shape so quickly. The auxiliary verbs have and has can be used in both the direct and indirect question. In the direct question has become before the subject, right? Before the subject. Can you see? In the direct question. In the indirect question has comes after the subject. Can you see here? After the subject. Okay. Okay? Now, how much okay. does, it, does this motorcycle cost? That is the direct question. I like to know, you see, this is not a question, it's a statement. So I finish the question with a period, okay? Now, I like to, more, I like to know how much. I eliminate does and this motorcycle because it's singular, I have to write the S, the inflection in, on the verb, cost. Are we clear? Okay. Yes? Yes. Okay, yes. now with modal auxiliaries, with modal auxiliaries, can, will, should, may, my, okay? Can you finish the project by tomorrow? Will it be possible? You see, this is a question. Will it be possible for you to finish the product by tomorrow? Or I can say, will it be possible 
you can finish the product by tomorrow is also good. So for indirect, for direct question, we can use the, fry, the phrase, will it be possible to make it direct? Can we change the meeting to Thursday? Is there any chance we could change the meaning to Thursday? So in this case, we change can to could, but not necessarily. You can also have use can. Is there a chance there we chance. can change the meaning oh, to Thursday? Cool. It's okay. Okay? Now, cool. we have open questions. Those are yes and no questions. And we have closed questions. I'm sorry, closed questions are yes and no questions. And open questions are, what time is it? Uh, it's eight o'clock. The answer is information, right? So that is an open question. Mm -hmm. These are closed questions because the answer is yes or the answer is no. Do you like, do you like coffee? Yes. No, right? So those are yes and no questions. So we need an if. For yes and no questions, we need an if in the indirect question. Take a look. Does Tom like the Italian food? So do you know if Tom likes Italian food? And again, I eliminate the does. Tom, because no, it's singular subject, likes no, Italian food. Likes. Okay? Now, are your parents joining us for dinner? Could you tell me if, because it's a yes and no question, if your parents, and you see, I changed this. If your parents are joining us for dinner. Okay? Do they speak English? I was wondering if I eliminate the do or does, if they speak English. And you see the verb, no es, because the subject is they. Is that clear? Yes. Has Barbara ever studied abroad? Do you know, and do you have any idea if Barbara has ever studied abroad? And then you can use the contraction, Barbara has. Okay, do you plan on traveling this summer? I like to know if you plan on traveling this summer. I like to know. Teacher, I, I have a question. Uh-huh. Uh, what is abroad? Abroad is out of your Abroad. country. Out of your country. Ah, okay. Okay. Guatemala is Thank abroad. You. China is abroad. Okay. Do you have Stella tips around? Yes. Okay. So now let's get into practice. Let's get into practice. So we're going to go. You remember here. I'm going to show you. You remember here. I have the links, okay? So mm -hmm. I'm going to pick up the second link. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can put it on your Google bar, okay? Put it in your the second uh, link. Can you share? Can you share the link in the chat, please? Yeah, I'm going to do that right now, okay? But I want you. I want you that okay. you remember that I told you that you get this. So you can have it in your computer, right? Okay. Yes. Okay, so this is the second link, okay, right here. Okay. Okay, so there you go. Okay? Thanks. That is the link. Thank you, teacher. Okay, very good. Now, do you have it? Okay, now, let me yes. pick it up, and I'm yes. going to upload it in my Google bar. I, I think I already have it right here, okay? So I come over here and I load, upload it on my Google bar and I give it a click, okay? Okay. So I have questions, you see, indirect questions only with the simple present, okay? For example, where does she play tennis? And they say that you use, can you tell me? So here, you are tell going me. to use, can you tell me? Uh-huh, and then, can you tell me? If she where, plays where tennis. I eliminate does. Remember, you put everything the same. You eliminate does. 
Can you Can tell me where, where she play? Uh -huh. Play where she play and the spend. verb because it's third person singular. And the verb because it's third person singular. I'm going to add an S. Okay, tennis. Mm -hmm. And because I'm using a question, can you tell me? I'm gonna have to close that with a question. Okay. Now, you want to see it? Mm -hmm. Check. Correct. Now show. Can you tell me where she plays tennis? Okay. Can you see it? Yes. Okay. Hello, Veronica. Hello. What happened, Veronica? Sleeping no. late, Veronica. <laughs> okay, so. No, now. teacher, I'm sorry. Ah, okay, no <laughs> problem. Now, let's go to number two. Now, you have to use, can you tell me? Because that's what it's asking. So I'm going to go again. And remember, I have, to, I have to use a capital C. Can you tell me? Tell me. Now, remember, this is a information question. Because where is information? The answer is information. This one is Yes and no question. So if. here we need if. Because here, does he live in Paris? Yes, he lives in Paris. No, he doesn't live in Paris. So it's a yes and no question. So here you need the if. This one, you don't need the if because it's information question. Where does she play tennis? Can you tell me where she plays tennis? Now, so... Can you tell me the rest? Can you tell me if I eliminate the dust? Can you tell me? I eliminate the dust. So he if, he if he and is. If he lives. Uh -huh. Now, lives because the subject is he. But it's a question. question. Which teacher a question? I have a question. What question? What is your question? In which computer are you reading? Because uh, in my in my computer, uh, I see in the your computer, but it's other other, uh, only in direct questions. But you are reading on other computer. In another computer? No, it's only one because computer. Because you are sharing. You don't share you the sharing. screen. Ah, okay. So no problem. I'm sure you're in a minute. Okay, probably, probably you are right. Okay, indirect questions, exercise. Okay. Now, can you see? Can you see it now? Yes. Okay. So, they have to... no, look. Yes. so the first yes. one is, the first question is, where does she play tennis? So it says that you use, can you um, tell me to introduce, to introduce your indirect sorry. question. So can you tell me where I eliminate the does she, can you where? see here she, and the verb because it's third person singular, I add an S. Because it's a she, tennis. Is that clear? Yes? Yes. Yes. Okay, yes. number two. Now, number two is a yes and no question. Does he live in Paris? Yes, he lives in Paris. No, he doesn't live in Paris. So the same, I use, can you tell me? So I write it right here. Can you tell me? Now, because it's can yes and no question, I need if. And then I eliminate the does. Can you tell me? And can then he me? lives can in Can you Paris. tell me if she... Okay. Can you tell me if he if lives he in, in Paris? Paris? And remember, because he's he, I use an S on the verb. Mm -hmm. Questions? 
Teacher, I have a question. Uh, sorry, I I didn't uh, connect uh, because I have to receive a call and you take the attendance and I didn't respond. Yeah, I know, but I mark I mark uh, present because you were present. Now you uh, pay attention thank you. in 15 thank you, minutes. Veronica, Madeleine, and Alicia, remind okay. me in 15 minutes to take the attendance again, okay? Okay, now let's go to the third. Oh. Let's go to the third. Okay, Is she okay. hungry? Okay. Is she hungry? Now I'm going to use the same. Can you tell me? So I'm going to write right here. Can you tell me if she is no, hungry? Now, now, wait, 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 wait. Now you have to ask yourself what kind of question is this? Yes and no question or question with information? What is the answer? What is the answer? Is she hungry? What is the answer? Can you tell me? No, what is the answer? What is the answer of the question? Is she hungry? Can you tell me? No, 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 no. Listen. Answer the question. Is she hungry? Yes, yes, she is. Yes. Ah, yes. Yes, mm -hmm. or yes, no. She is. Yes, she is. Okay. So, mm -hmm. this oh, is, is a yes and no question. Mm -hmm. This is a yes mm -hmm. and no question. Mm -hmm. So, you need if. Because it is yeah. a yes and if no question. She hungry? For example, where it said right here, where does she play tennis? In the park. So, you see, the answer is no yes. The answer is no no. The answer is information. Here, we don't use if. Okay? Now, when it's a yes and no question, because the answer is yes or no, in that one, we need if. Is that clear? So, can yes, you tell me if... If she is hungry. If she is hungry. She is hungry. Oh. And with a question mark, because... We start with a question. Okay, so you check, question and it's mark. good. You show, can you tell me if she is hungry? Are we clear now? With a question mark at the end or not? Uh, yes, can you see question mark at the end? Why? Because know. this is a question. This is a question. Now, yes. look at number four. Now, the first thing, what is this? Is a yes and no question or information question? Information question. So we don't need if. We don't need if. So we're going to write the same. And you can tell me what is it? Well, this is no this if, is, no if, because it's not it's a yes and no what, question. What is, what, is, what, what, is, is, what is what is what is this is? Can you tell me what this is? Now check. Perfect. Show. Can Teacher, you tell me what, what this, this is? is? Teacher. Yes. I have a question. Is uh, is a uh, is most uh, I don't know say, but you always have to put the the verb to be uh, in the final end. the last sentence. Not in the final. You put the verb to be after the subject. So what is the subject here? This. So you put the verb to be after the subject. Not at the end. Not always at the end. But you will see later. Okay? So okay. you put it after the subject. Okay. okay? Now, can you see here? Okay. Here. Okay. Are your parents joining us for dinner? Yeah. Let me see. Uh, let me share the screen. Can you see this? Hello? Yes, teacher. Okay, are your parents Hello. joining us for dinner? dinner? So here, 
It's a yes and no question. So could you tell me if your parents yes. are joining us for dinner? So are is after the subject. What is the subject? Your parents. So are becomes after the subject. After the subject. Not at the end. Not at the end. Okay. In this case, in this case, it is, it is, let me, in this case, is a coincidence that is at the end because the is is after the subject. It's a coincidence. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Do they work in Canada? Can you tell me if they work in Canada? Can you tell me if? If they, they work, they if, work if, 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 right, 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 if, because the answer is yes. Do they work in Canada? If yes. They work in no. Canada. So it's a yes and no question. If they, they work, if they, they work, work, they work. Ah, and I put an S. Put an S or no, no S? No, 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 no S. Why? Right, yes. Because no. the subject is they. And for they, we don't put an S, okay? So work in Canada. In Canada. And question mark. Okay, so we check. Perfect. So can you tell me if they work in Canada? Questions, questions. They now, remember, but okay, now look. When we are, we have this type of a uh, quest double H words when, what, where, ah, we don't use if. Okay, when we have what, when, where, when, how much, how long, okay, we don't use if because those are mm -hmm. information questions. The answer is information. What is your name, Robert? What is the answer? Information. So if I say, are you Robert? What is the answer? Yes, I am Robert. Or okay. no, I am not Robert. Mm -hmm. So in that case, it's a yes and no question. Is that clear? Okay, yes. we are going to do yes. a couple more. Okay, number six. Can you tell me? Exactly, can you? Can you... Tell, tell me, me, and now? When John and Laura met. When John and Luke are. Luke are. No, no, are. Meet. Meet, exactly. Meet. Only meet. 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 And why not Teacher, meet with us? Why not meet with us? Because John and Luke is they. So they doesn't take an S. Only Luke, yes. Only John, yes. Are we clear? Okay. Let's check. Very good. Show. No, yes. Can you no, tell me yes. when John and Luke meet? Okay. Yes. Okay, number seven. What is it? Do you know is do you know if he is allowed? Yet? Tell me. Do you can know? You me if me. He yeah, I can use do you know, but in this case, on this case, can you tell wait, 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 Osman. Yeah, I can yeah. use do you know, but in this case, the exercise asked me that I only use. Can you tell me? If okay. I use do you know, it's gonna it's gonna take it wrong. Do you understand? Okay, in this specific okay. exercise, in this specific exercise. Okay. okay, so I have to use, can you tell me? Can, can you tell, tell me, me if, if he is a lawyer? If, exactly, if, if, if he, he is, is a lawyer. A lawyer. lawyer, exactly, if, very good, and question mark. Okay, is that clear? If, because he's suggesting no question. Perfect. Show. 
Can you tell me if he is a lawyer? Is that clear? Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 Are you sure? Yes. Yes. I'm sure. Ask questions, everybody. I want to know what is your opinion, everybody. Can you tell me, teacher? Um, Can you tell me when the party is? Uh huh. Ask. Ask questions. Remember, no. teacher. Yes, is, I'm listening. No. Uh -huh. Is not is in the end. Is not what. Is, 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 no, is because no, what do no, we say? Is, okay, very is, good question. Very good question. We say that we are going to place is after the subject. What is the subject? Is he. So he. you see, is is after the subject, which is he. Do you remember this? Yes. It says right here. Okay, it says right here. A uh, question with our ah here. Ah, okay. So in indirect questions with is and are, the verb is comes after after the subject. What is the subject here? Market Street. So, can you tell me where Market Street is? Okay, but in this one. The name, it's the name. In this one, uh-huh, in this one, are your parents joining us for dinner? Could you tell me if your parents, what is the subject? Your parents. So you are going to write R, after your parents, and it's okay. right there, after the subject. Is that Very clear, Jadar? Yes, teacher, thank you. Yes, okay, very good, so let's continue. Okay, when is the party? Can you tell me? Can you tell me? Can you tell me? me? Yes. Aha, very when good. Is. When the party, party is. 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 When the party is. Very good. Is. Can you tell me when the party is? Very good. Why? Because is goes after the subject. What is the subject? The party. Okay, so check. Very good. Party. Very good. Okay. Now remember, this is in the present, in the present. We are working only in the present. Okay, now, number nine, do they often go out? Come on, tell me, tell me. Can you tell me? Can you tell me? If they? If, uh -huh, because it's a yes and no question, very good. Can you tell me if, if they often go out? If they often go out. You see how simple this is? Very good. Check. Excellent. Can you tell me if they often go out? Okay. Now we have 10 more questions. Okay. I want you, do you have the link? The link is right there in the chat. So I want you to take the link and put it in your computer because I want okay. you that you work in pairs. Is that clear? Okay. Okay. Clear? Okay. Okay, let me know yes. when you have the link in your computer or in your phone. Take the link. Here's the link. I have Take it, the teacher. Link and put it in your computer. Okay? Do you have it? Mm -hmm. Everybody? Yes. Yes, yes, I have, have it. Yes. Yeah. Vanessa, do you have the link? Yes. 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 Okay, I'm going to yes, break I'm you ready. into groups. Okay? Going to break you into groups. Oh, my God. It's not this one. Sorry. Okay. Eight groups. 
Okay, I want A groups. Okay, here we go. Okay, get into your group, please. Get into in pairs and start working, please. Okay, get in, get in. Beatriz, get in, Beatriz. Ani Nunez, get in, please. Álvaro, alone, Álvaro. Who are you today? Álvaro, Álvaro. Hello, teacher. Ajá, uh -huh. so do you have the link? Yes, I have the link. Put the link, share the link with me. Um, I don't know if I'm able to do that from my cell phone. Okay, no problem. Okay, I have it right here. Can you see it? Let's see. Can you see the screen? Can't. But you have the link. You have the link in your cell phone. Don't share it. Yes. Okay, now tell me what is number 10. Number 10 is, can you tell me uh, what does he no, no do? No, what does. Remember, what you did, eliminate did, the does. What he? What he did in the no, weekend. No, not did, not did, in the present. What he does. Uh -huh. Can, Can you, you tell, tell me what me? he does at the weekend? Exactly. With a question mark. Write it down. Can you tell me what he does at the weekend? Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, number 11. It could be, can you tell me if... Uh, if the children are on holiday this week. Exactly, very good, Alvaro, very good. Now, number 12. Okay, can you tell me who is who she is? Perfect, very good, 13. Can you tell me why uh, why you like to travel so much? Why you like traveling so much? Very good, that is perfect. Number 14. Let's see. Can you tell me if Lisa like ice cream? Uh-huh, now, like, because we're talking about Lisa. She, you have like. to write S. If Lisa likes ice cream, mm -hmm. okay? If Lisa likes ice cream, very good. 15. Okay, can you tell me if they are from Chile? If they are from Chile, very good. Number 16. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me where the station is? Where the station is, perfect, very good. Number 17. Okay. Can you tell me where you study Chinese? Excellent, very good, 18. Can you tell me where the nearest supermarket is. Excellent, next. Okay, let's see. Can you tell me if you drink coffee? Can you tell me if you drink coffee? Perfect, number 20. The last one it says, can you tell me if Richard always no. is late? Can you tell me if Richard? Is always late? Exactly, he's yes. always late, very good. Okay, now we're gonna go back to the groups, to the whole group, okay? Okay, teacher, thank you. Hey, very good, very good practice. Okay, thank you.
Excellent work. Okay, very good. I'm going to check this. Jader Edemer. Present teacher. Thank you. Blanca Estela. Maria Eugenia Cruz de Magaña. Present teacher. Thank you. Bessie Anayensi. Present. Thank you. Oscar Eduardo Majano. Present. Thank you. Raúl Mauricio Rivera. Present. Thank you. Mini B. Saraí. Mini B. Saraí. Present. Ah, thank you. Eh, Marta Beatriz Alegría. Present. Thank you. Álvaro Enrique Rivas. Present, teacher. Thank you. Rafael René Molina. Present, sir. Thank you. María Adelina Araya. Present, teacher. Okay, very good. Alicia Carolina López. Present, teacher. Ah, okay. Osman Enrique Hernández. Osman Enrique Hernández. Present teacher. Ah, Present. Okay, very good. Cecilia Fuentes. Daniel Osvaldo Pérez. Verónica Beatriz. Verónica Beatriz. Present. Ah, ok, very good, very good. Eh, Ana del Carmen Núñez. De Núñez. Present Ana teacher. del Carmen de Núñez. Ah, Present okay. teacher. Thank you. Andrea. Present. Absent. Andrea. Eh, Kenia. En Vanessa Alexandra Armas. Present. Ok, very good. Now. Excellent. Now, let's see. Now I want you, okay, we are going to do this very quick, okay? Now we are going to go to the next link, okay? And I'm going to paste it. I'm going okay. to paste it in the chat, okay? Here we go. Okay. Okay, so here's the next link. Okay, I'm gonna paste it on the chat room. Okay, and it's right here. Okay, so pick it up, pick it up, please. Okay, pick it up and paste it on your Google bar. Quickly, quickly, please, because we don't have much time. Please, don't share. It's right there, it's the third link. It's the third link. Yes, Madeline, he's pasted. I pasted it in the he chat. He pasted the link in the in the in the chat. Uh -huh, in the chat. So we go to the it, chat teacher. room and pick it up from there. Okay. I have it. Thank you, Alicia. Okay, here's the third oh, link. Okay. okay. I'm Thank going you. to paste it. I'm gonna close I have some it, links. Teacher. Okay. I'm gonna close some links here. Okay. So here we go. This one I'm gonna close it. Now, the rest, you can do it at home, the rest of the exercises, okay? Now, remember, okay. tomorrow we are going to practice this all night long tomorrow. Now, we mm -hmm. did it with the present. Okay. Now, we are going to do it with the simple pass. Can you see right here? Mm -hmm. Simple, simple pass. pass. Now, they want us to use, do you know, okay? No, can you tell me? Now we are going to use, do you know? Do you okay? know? So, for example, what is it right here? Do, do you know? Do you Done. know? Uh -huh. We eliminate did. And remember, is this yes and no question or is you know, information she, question? She, she, do you know? know? Do you know she if goes, she... If, exactly. If she... Because it's a yes and no question. Last night? If she... Do you know if she goes? 
she went. Uh -huh. If she went. went, because it's in the past. Now uh, she walk in the know, present. She went. If, if she, she went, went out, she went out last, night. Night. Oh, last night. And because it's also a question, we write a question mark. Share your okay. screen. Check. It's okay. Is that it's right, not. last night? Do you know if she went out last night? Because now we are talking <laughs> about the present. We are not talking about the present. We're talking about a question in the past, in the simple past. Okay, the next one. What is the next one? Where did she meet? Do, do, you know, do you know? Do you know? Do you know if? No, no, if. Uh, where, where, sí. where, where? No, yo me imaginaba que aquí, pero eh, no en esa puerta, sino en esa Álvaro, puerta. Álvaro, Álvaro. Hey, can you turn off the microphone, please? Hey, can you turn off the microphone, please? We hear all the conversation that you have over there. Okay, now, do you know? Do you know where she... Do you know where... Where she, you remember, you eliminate this and you use the past tense of this verb. When is the simple past? So, what is the past tense of meet? Meet. Met. 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 Do you know where she met her brother? She met her brother. Her brother. And question. Because we introduce the indirect question with a question. No. Okay, wow. so check. Very good. Show. Do you know where she met her brother? Do you know? Questions. Where? questions. Do you have any questions? No. No. No? Okay, now let's continue with the next one. How was the film? Do, do you know? Do you know? No. How? How? No. The film was. The film was. How the film? The film was. Was excellent. And question mark. Check. Perfect. Very good. Do you know how the film was? Yes. Okay, now the next question. The next question, let's do see. Do you know? Do you know? If David you know, was the first. If, if David if, was the first. Was if David, the first arrived. If David was the right. first. The first to arrive. Yes. Okay, and yes. question mark. Is that clear? Do you know if David was the first to arrive? Yes. Do you know? Okay, now look. Very good. It now look. Lucy. The rest, the rest, you do it at home. Now I need to talk to you about something real quick. Okay? Now. Look, next Friday, not this Friday, next Friday, we are going to stop the class at nine o'clock because you need to make okay. the survey. What is the survey? The survey is questions. I mean, is your opinion about Inglés Corporativo and your opinion about the teacher, okay? So okay. you have to write. I will give it's you. A great teacher. Uh -huh. Okay. So that's going to be next Friday at nine o'clock. Okay. Now. Okay. okay. Another thing I will, I will give you and they will send you, they will send you a link next week. And that link is to enter to the survey. But there is information that you have to write on the survey. So I will guide you with that information. And then when you are going to answer the questions, I will leave you alone. 
So you can answer the questions freely. Is that clear? Okay. Yes. Okay. So, uh, INSA for, uh, no, Inglés Corporativo's uh, uh, backup team are going to send you that link. Okay. So, that is one thing. Another. Okay. Now, another. Okay. Remember that INSA for is a uh, checking. And they, uh, they told us today they're going to be checking the minutes. Okay. So the minimum minutes that you need, like for example, in order to fulfill this, this, uh, uh, this group, because we have 50 hours and 50 hours times 60 minutes is 3000 minutes. So you are allowed to be absent only 20%. So 20% of, of 3,000 minutes is 600 minutes. So in order for you to be promoted to the next level, you need minimum 2,400 minutes. Okay? I will put this on the board right here. Okay? So minimum, you need... 2,400 minutes, okay? In order to be promoted to the next level. If you don't have 2,400 minutes, you are not going to be promoted, okay? So what I'm telling you is, please try to be present all the sessions from now on so you won't have any problems with those 2400 meters minutes is that clear yeah, yeah. okay quedó claro eso yes yeah eso lo voy a decir en español rápidamente mire insafor no lo va a promover a usted a intermedio 3 si usted no tiene como mínimo eh, presente en, en en las videoconferencias 2400 minutos Así que si usted ya faltó varias veces, trate de ya no faltar para que usted tenga como mínimo 2,400 minutos. ¿Ok? Ok. Because okay. INSA4 is checking the minutes in Zoom. In Zoom. ¿Ok? Ok, now, what I can do is next Wednesday and next, well, next Tuesday and next Thursday, I can extend the class 10 or 15 more minutes, okay? Just in case uh, we need those minutes. Is that clear? So everybody yes. is going to be together, yes. okay? Practicing, okay. okay? Well, thank you very much for today's Good class. Picture. And remember, tomorrow we're gonna practice this, info, this indirect questions, okay, orally. Today we only did it okay. uh, written, but tomorrow we're going to do it orally. So please don't miss tomorrow's class. Thank you very okay. much for your attendance. Okay. Thank you. Okay, I'll see you okay. tomorrow. Have a good night. Rest, good night. please. Good and night. be ready for tomorrow. Okay? Okay. Bye. 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 And Vanessa, Bye. go Bye. eat, Bye. please. Okay? Yes, I'm ready. Go to, to the kitchen and eat something. <laughs> And yeah. Chicken okay. or kitchen. Okay. Well, have a wonderful night tonight. Okay. Bye. Bye. -bye. I need ah. a I need a chicken. I need a chicken. You did chicken today. Okay. Bye -bye. Very good. Bye. Bye, Bye, guys. See you tomorrow. Have a wonderful see night. See you tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow.